Hi friends, this is Firearm Pop, and I wanted to do a quick review uh, of my CZ82. Uh, we'll see here how it goes. Um, first off, let's talk about the CZ82 itself. Let's take it out. This is the way it usually comes. Uh, there's an extra mag and a lanyard, which we'll put on the side for now and we'll just look at the CZ82 itself, okay? Just like that. Just so everybody is comfortable, this gun is safety checked. Nothing in the magazine, nothing in the chamber here. Okay, so let's talk about the CZ82 for a minute. It's a semi-automatic uh, pistol made in Czechoslovakia and the service history, okay, is it was in service from 1983 to 1999 in Czech, Czechoslovakia and the, uh, since 1993 in the Czech Republic and the Slovak Republic. The production history is the designer was Ostentin Nikas, and it was designed in 1982. The variance is the CZ83, which is the civilian version. The specifications of the weight is 82 ounce empty and 32 ounce fully loaded. The length is uh, 6.8 inches. The barrel length is, is 3.8 inches. The width is one and a quarter inches. See that right there, and the height is five inches. The cartridge this model takes the 9x18 Makarov. Uh, they also make one for the 380 ACP and one for the 32 ACP, uh, which is the 83 only. The action is blowback double action. The muzzle velocity is 1,001 foot per second. The effective range is 55 yards, and the feed system is a 12-round staggered column detachable box magazine, and uh, the sights are fixed front blade rear drift adjustable for windage. So you can see here that the rear sight is adjustable, and the magazine is a 12-round magazine. Now, this gun only comes with 12 round magazines, so it's, uh, okay, one of the primary features of this, uh, this gun is that it, it, the, it was the first service pistol to feature both of these features. The bore is chrome plated, which gives it a three advantages, longer barrel life, uh, resistance to rust and the use of corrosive ammunition and the ease of cleaning. Another p feature of the pistol is the use of polygonal rifling in the barrel bore. This replaces the traditional lands and grooves rifling design with a rounded smooth polygonal uh, pattern which is a more hills and valleys appearance. I wish I could get a close up enough view of that for you but I just don't think that's possible. Uh, <clears throat> this this gun is available under the Curios and Relics. The version 82 was added to the U.S. government's Curio and Relic list with the Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco, and Firearms and Explosives in February 2007. After an individual wrote the letter to the ATF, attaching a letter from the Federal Museum curator who stated that the CZ-82 had museum interest as a curio and relic. Okay, uh, again, the users were the Czech Republic and uh, Slovakia. And that covers pretty much all the history of the gun. I, you know, I really, really like this gun. It's the right size. Uh, it really is a nice compact design. Uh, holding 12 rounds and uh, and it's just the right weight
does have a safety. It's not a decocker, just a safety. It is fully uh, uh, double action or single action. Okay. And the teardown is pretty much the same as the Makarov. Okay. You pull the the uh, the trigger guard off, and then pull back and pull and pull that off. And that's all there is to disassembly. That's it. Uh, I I love that design, and it's it, the the barrel is mounted. Okay, so and it goes back pretty much the same way. Put that back in, slide it forward. Put that back up, and you're done. That is the CZ82. And it says right on it, I don't know how much you can see, but it says CZ82, and there's the importer, CAI, Georgia, Vermont. Uh, some serial numbers you don't need. This one does have some markings on it. There's, there is some, some chipping of the uh, of the finish but that's okay we are going to take this back out to the range I only had it to the range once and the weather has been since I've gotten it the weather has been so awful I haven't really gotten a chance to take it back and do some more shooting with it but you're going to see some videos coming up real soon with that and like I said this was a uh, <clears throat> a little bit of a Go over the, the, the gun, so uh, we're going to see how this comes out, and uh, hope you enjoy and found this informational. This is Fire on Pop. Be safe out there, and God bless. Bye now.